Hello, it's Becca, and welcome to an autumn afternoon here at our little farmhouse on the northern plains of Iowa. Today, I just wanted to share some tips and ideas on how to make your home extra cozy and homey for autumn time. So as always, I'm so glad you're here with me today and have stopped by for a visit here at our home, the carriage house. So one of my favorite ways to make a home cozy, safe, and inviting is to make a stove top simmer pot. I put a little bit of water in a small pot, set it on the stove on low heat, and then add your favorite aromatic spices. And this time of year, I love to use cinnamon bark, cloves, mulling spices, which I just bought in Amish country last week. But you can use any combination of scents that you love in your home. Maybe it's a combination of scents that represent warm memories in your life but you could always do fresh orange peel with cinnamon and clove and you could also use essential oils in your simmer pot as well another way to add layers of autumn goodness into your home is by doing a little fall baking not only does this help make time for you to experience slow living but it can help you be present in the moment and enjoy those little things that life has to offer you could put your favorite jazz music on or one of your favorite movies that you absolutely adore right now I'm making spiced autumn pumpkin bread so really looking forward forward to having this kitchen smell heavenly this afternoon and if you have children or grandchildren even though they may not say anything the sights and smells of something warm being baked in the oven it is an unspoken comfort that can fill their little hearts with love and warmth <laughs> Another way to honor fall this year in your home is by crafting, making little DIY projects to have in your home or to give them away as a gift. So I do want to thank Viver for sponsoring today's visit. I have their Black Arbor Press, which I'm really excited about using this autumn and the upcoming holidays, and I'm sure you would too. But today I'm making a fall leaf napkin ring. I have a cute little fall leaf stamp, pretty cloth napkins, and a piece of leather, which that's what I and my husband, I'm going to need his help uh, today. So, But that that's what we're using to stamp the leaf on. And then we'll attach some buttons to the ring, so I'll show you. It'll be really cute. But this one is Viver's um, one-ton desktop cast iron hand press that's perfect for stamping stretching you can also make jewelry it's perfect for that but I will leave a link down below to their wonderful press and then we're going to show you what everything looks like
there's something magical about making a soup from scratch during these cool autumn evenings, and that's another way to cozy up your home for this fall. It's such a wonderful way to honor autumn, and tonight I'm making a vegetable soup with freshly cut carrots, celery, and onions, along with dried peas, lentils, and rice. And I will link all these recipes down below. So I'm going to put on some relaxing jazz for you and I to enjoy while I make this delicious autumn harvest soup. Yeah, right. 